Hey gang, it's Jeff Black here again from Beachmont Floor Performance, and as usual, I'm out here hanging out in the garage for another episode of Garage Table Discussions. Uh, I get asked a lot about the garage itself. Um, everybody, for whatever reason, thinks my garage is kind of cool, which, hey, I like that. So what I thought I'd do today is actually kind of take you around a little bit and show you a couple of key things that I have in my garage that make it enjoyable and fun for me to hang out in the garage. All right, let's take a little look. Okay, so gang, let's head this way a little bit. I want to kind of just show you uh, a little bit of some of the pictures I have up here of some of the cars that we've owned over the years. I don't have everything up here because uh, I honestly used to not take pictures of the cars back when I was a little younger. I don't know, I just wasn't into taking pictures that much. Uh, but uh, I've got a few things here. So that was Carol's 15 GT uh, with the or first GT350 I had. That car, the black car, the topless lady, was really kind of the first performance type build that I did with Charlie. Uh, ordered that car and did some custom upgrades, took it to Roush and actually had a supercharger installed and so forth. Uh, then the 68, there's a shot here of four of the cars together. Uh, couldn't fit all of them in there because we did have the 15 also at the same time. But uh, then again, another shot of the topless lady. This car up here was a great car. I uh, actually bought that from a friend of ours named Mike Muse. Uh, he and his daughter did a full frame off restoration on that 67 convertible. It's actually a GT uh, with the hypo and gorgeous car, gorgeous car. Uh, this was actually one of my funnest cars, though, to be honest with you, the uh, yellow 67. Uh, that was just a 289, but it was a blast of a car to drive. And the car that kind of started me down the performance side uh, is the 04 Torch, Torch Red Terminator. That car was the car that started it all for me as far as performance stuff. And let me show you a few other pictures of that car here. Um, these are, again, some pictures I took over time. Uh, the engine, obviously, I had some custom badges made that showed uh, here, this one, no, sorry, with the uh, VIN number, the build date, and so forth on it. Just, just a fabulous car. Uh, man, anybody who knows anything about Terminators knows what I'm talking about here. And as you can see, I've got some uh, plates from over the years. Um, got my fridges. That's the important thing out here. And, of course, the uh, workbench area here. Got the display of the Shelby stuff up here. Got my tunes. In case anybody ever comes over, we can crank up some tunes. And then one of the most important things to have in a garage is your television. You know, so you can sit out here and watch the game or have something on while you're working out in the garage. Um, you get to see some of the behind the scenes here with the lights and everything that we use when I film garage table. It does make everything look so much better. Uh, if we work our way over here, oh well, I should back up a second, sorry. Got some of the stuff on display here, you know, uh, some pictures. This was when the uh, White Knight was in Stang magazine. I had those uh, made up. This is something that my wife helped me design, Carol. i uh, got some plexiglass here and mounted a bunch of the car trophies from when I was, I was more into going car shows uh, for a while. The local club, the Renegades, I got a trophy from them. The Lauren Hill trophy, uh, you name it, just a bunch of trophies up there. This is a little special wall for me that I'm going to add some more stuff to eventually. Uh, maybe you know that I am a big fan of Gail Halderman and his museum, which is up the road from us in Tip City, his family, his daughter Karen, his granddaughter Lauren are good friends of mine. I love those people. And for Beachmont Ford Performance, we were very honored. This here is the original, I guess I'll call it proof of a plaque that we had made for the Halderman barn and presented to them. And I've got the original proof here in the garage. Uh, I'll tell you what, one last thing we'll walk over here, because this is something that we got to have. Our Beachmont Ford Performance Banner. And uh, that is something that I am very, very excited about, because it's, uh, it's been something that's been almost a dream come true to be working in this industry and be working for Beachmont Ford and Beachmont Ford Performance. All right, guys, there you go. A quick tour of the garage. I 
Don't know exactly why everybody loves the garage so much, uh, but I'm glad they do, and I'm glad to have brought you a little tour of the garage. So thanks again for joining me on Garage Table Discussion. I will see you again in two weeks, and once again, as always, thank you for watching, and God bless. Bye-bye.